Hello and welcome to this Crazy Talk 7 video tutorial on how to use the new interactive plugin to create talking avatars for web and app design. Okay, so the inter interactive plugin is basically a new add-on for developers and this allows you uh, not just to export the animation in a video animation as we did in the past, but actually exporting the animation data. And this will allow your students, your customers, your audience in general to interact with a live avatar on your web page. So what can this do? This can basically help you transform this, a static website, into an interactive presentation with a live avatar that presents itself and the information that you want to convey at the moment you want. Hello and welcome to David's Holiday Catering. During your visit, we hope we can answer some of your questions regarding our company and catering services. Okay, and as you can see, it's interactive, he's following my cursor, and I can program additional animations to pop up. Our services are especially designed for any event. We cater to birthdays, retirements, funerals, bar mitzvah, and graduation. And we can even apply foregrounds like this. So when your customers click on it, they can receive price, va uh, price quotations or even contacts for your company and services. Okay? So we, show, we have several showcases to give you a better idea of what you can do. We have some commercial showcases for businesses and companies, and we also have educational scenarios. So for example, for a commercial host, you can just have it present your website, just like this. So, you have a great product that's different, and you have a vision to make it stand out from the rest. Well, I can help you with that, as I am a different kind of host, as I can deliver information in a casual and natural way. Just like a newscaster or a channel host, I can help drive and engage your audience by presenting information while I talk, or I can move out of the way when you choose. Okay. I can also apply something uh, for an FAQ, Frequently Asked Questions. Hi, I'm Jane, and I'm here to help you with any questions. Okay, so when a customer clicks on a question, can I use my own avatar by using my own photo? Sure. Simply import a clear, forward-looking face photo and complete the face fitting process to create your own avatar. Okay, so what if I'm a company and I want to have my own customized company logo, my branded logo, up when the player is loading or I want to have foregrounds with my company logo. Can I do that? Can I add my own logo? Of course. Once you export the avatar from Crazy Talk, you can then add custom foreground or background images and click banners to link them back to your website. Okay, so you're not restricted to the content that Crazy Talk has. You can create your own content, you can bring your own themes, you can bring your own logo, and you can layer this over on your own HTML page and customize the presentations that you like. So besides having commercial, uh, a commercial aspect to this, you can also employ it in education. Okay, let's see how well you know your American history. Okay, so Question I can... Question one. <laughs> Who was the first president of the United States of America? So I can go through several rounds of questions and I can answer these. Question two. In what year was the United States Declaration of Independence signed? Question five. Originally, how many colonial states were there during colonial rule? Great job. You paid attention in school. Okay. So that's very easy. And it's as simple as creating your own animations in Crazy Talk and then exporting these animations and coding them into your own HTML page. So how is this done? Once you create the animations in Crazy Talk with your own voice grips and your lip syncing and your animations, you simply have to export with the interactive plugin. You can export these projects and save them, okay? Once you save these projects, then you will be able to uh, use the codes that we have generated for you. So down here we have sample codes. So these sample codes apply to different functions uh, that you want to, to apply. So for example, if I simply want to load a project like I did here, then I just have to go into those sample codes and take a look at the codes that we have generated for you. Hi, I'm Jane. Okay, so that's what I would like to do. I simply copy this code and then I open the coding, uh, the coded HTML of my own website. So I have this in here and I can simply open it with Dreamweaver, go into the code lines and just fill inside wherever um, wherever we have to. So for example it says copy this code 
and bring this in where it says where we have the head of the project okay the beginning of the head of the coding head and the end so I simply have to go inside and we see the code for that the, the, the area for the code and I simply copy paste that and then it's just a matter of fixing the parameters I fix the the call links the URL links where I have my project saved uh, the, my player saved my project saved and also the idle motion so you can save these uh, both on a locally uh, on, on a local computer you can do this offline or you can put all these assets your projects your your idle motions on a server or on Dropbox and then it's, a, it's just a matter of customizing that URL to call these uh, these projects from online and this will allow you to create these lovely projects without actually knowing how to do any type of programming okay so that is the crazy talk interactive plugin in a nutshell we hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Uh, we got more tutorials coming in. Where we're going to show you how to do exactly how to do step by step all these coding lines, how to do the copy pasting and everything. So stick around. We have more tutorials coming. Thank you.